2012 Topps Allen & Ginter has made its way into hobby stores and also the uh, retail outlets such as Walmart and Target. Although we haven't seen a lot of Target, they are out there. Uh, and there's a look at the box and there are a total of eight packs, six cards per pack. Here is a look at the wrapper and uh, just picked up the one box to see what was inside creating a lot of buzz these are online and we thought it was interesting that the base cards that came out of here do have some kind of a sequence that matches the hobby boxes a lot of you probably figured that out if you're real serious diehard fans uh, this was the same sequence that came out of the hobby box that we saw opened uh, by someone else uh, in this sequence in this pack here uh, reflected later on as well in some of the other packs that were uh, opened up with the hobby box and again you see some of the historical uh, cards that you get with Allen and Ginter Ben Franklin and electricity the world's tallest uh, building and as well as we got some uh, Olympic cards there's Michael Phelps we pulled out Rulon Gardner and some of the uh, parallels what's in a name which uh, delves into some of the players full names uh, you see Mark Teixeira there and some of the minis we got a Niger Morgan parallel Card of Brahms for you music fans, Carlos Beltran, uh, Adrian Gonzalez, uh, Aoki, Upton, Mike Schmidt, and Santana. So no autograph card in this pack or this box. And uh, uh, so we didn't get our money's worth, obviously. That's the key to these whole, uh, you know, opening the, the blaster boxes. Uh, 20 bucks, they're not really much of a deal unless you're pulling a, an autograph card. We've had some success with that, but not with this one. Uh, the autograph cards that are being sold on eBay are generally doing very well. Um, the reports that uh, we see uh, that the, the big stuff is, is selling well. If you want more information, head to our website, sportscollectorsdaily.com. There's our preview that ran back in January, has all the information, and of course we've had updated stories since then with some of the autograph signers that have been added and what people are pulling out of the boxes.